Unit Two. I see you, Taiwan. Reading. Let me introduce you to a place I love, Taiwan. When I lived in Georgia, I noticed Taiwan is listed among the top ten countries in the world to visit. After seven years of living in Taiwan, I totally agree with that. I am in love with its natural scenery, delicious foods, free society, and good quality of life. Natural beauty and delicious foods are the soul of Taiwan. Though Taiwan is a small island, it has a wide variety of mountain and ocean views. In Taroka Gorge, I could hear the Liu River flowing while I enjoyed the sight of marble cliffs all around me. Donggong is another place that shouldn't be missed. On my first visit there, I took a walk along the beach and felt the wind brushing against my face. I watched the sunset painting the ocean surface orange as I breathed in the salty sea air. I also went to a fish market to enjoy some fresh seafood and street foods. Of course, I did not miss the chance to try some tuna. It was so fresh and tender. I also tried the famous oyster omelet. It came at the perfect temperature and with a special hot sauce on top. I really loved its strong taste. After this trip, I became a big fan of Taiwan's delicious foods. Taiwan's free society is also impressive. This young democracy is mature and diverse. There were several demonstrations during my stay in Taiwan, and I even joined one myself. There, I listened to others talk, sing, and exchange ideas. I heard people freely express their views on political and social issues. From this experience, I learned that Taiwanese people may not always see things the same way, but differences are respected. Finally. I am impressed by the good quality of life in Taiwan. One reason for this is that people here don't have to worry when they need health care. With Taiwan's national health insurance program, I can see a doctor with a short waiting time and at a low cost. In fact, Taiwan's health care is often ranked best in the world. My experiences here have given me everything I could hope for and more. Because of this, I see this country as my second home. I really look forward to my next seven years in Taiwan.